whether you're going to go to New York or whether you're going to stay in Bamberg and have some kind of celebration there? Definitely before the, uh, the week of the draft. You know, I thought I sit down and weigh out my options. You know, I talked to my mother about the situation. You know, I'll come up with a decision and I'll let everyone know what I'm going to do. I'll be the one who asked it. Miguel Chavis had a pretty good figure out there today, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> you got to love Miguel. Ever since I walked on campus, and in my, I remember my first workout, you know, coming out of high school, you don't see many guys get naked in one. <laughs> Miguel, I think Miguel and Ricky Sapp were the first two guys I seen strip down the tights and just take off running. You know, and I was a little bit overwhelmed, but about two weeks later, I was doing the same thing, trying to lose weight, and trying to compete with those guys. So, you gotta love it. At least the NFL saw every bit of him. Too. <laughs> every bit. Hey, <laughs> Quan, have you gone back this year and, and looked at on tape you before the knee and after the knee? Have, have you compared? Definitely. What, for those of us who haven't seen it, what? What shows up? Do you see, ah, uh, I couldn't do this then that I could do earlier? Does Definitely, stuff show up? No, I, after I hurt my knee, I saw the change in my game. You know, I, I fought through it, but my get off wasn't as fast as it was the first part of the season. You know, I, I couldn't run for long periods of time and chase things down from the back as I did my first part of the season. You know, I, it was a number of things that I could tell that that wasn't up to par, but you know, like Coach Swinney always says, you know, you only know when you're giving it y'all. Everybody else knows when you're not. So, you know, it wasn't a big issue. You know, I, nobody could really tell if I was hurt or not. But, you know, I knew. You my coaches knew. Okay. You didn't consider getting surgery right away, shutting it down? and No, because at that point in time, I couldn't think about anything but my teammates in my season. You know, uh, you know we put a lot of heart and, heart and hard work into the season and off season with the spring and the winter. You know, we thought we'd do a whole lot better, but I just couldn't force myself out of my teammates like that, knowing what type of role that I was playing and knowing that I was a leader of the team. I just couldn't, I couldn't bring myself to sit out four or five games.